leo niko hapa sasa juzi niliposikia babangu Joho asema kwamba nataka kusimama ngasema mimi nitakuwa mtu wa mwisho kumpinga na mimi mara nyingi huwa nawaambia wapwani kama jambo pinginepo hutaki kununga mkono lakini unaweza kuwa sasa kulipinga pia utakuwa umelitia chime kuliko ati kwa sababu humpendi joho lakini pia wataka kujionyesha kwamba nataka kumpiga na faida gani tumekuwa tukitafuta nani atakayeweza kusimamia urais hapa alipatikana alijaribu kibule alikosa kura toko nyumbani nafikiri yote tuliona kama historia sasa tu, eh? sasa ni mambo ambayo tunayajua kwa hivyo ninachowaomba kama tumekata shauri kusimama kwa msimamo umoja wa kusema kwamba tunataka kujikomboa na kwamba joho kwa sababu yeye amejiamini kwamba nataka niwe mbele sisi tumuungeri mkono tumuungeri mkono kwa sababu hivyo vita atakavyopigana navyo havitakuwa vidogo sasa ni ile mitihani itakayokuja itakuwa mafatwa nyinyi kwamba wewe utakubali kuitwa hivi haya hayatatusaidia wacha sisi na sisi maana hii timu hii peke yake mheshimiwa joho akapiganiwa rais basi ataka kosa kupata kwa bahati mbaya lakini hii timu akiwa nayo watamheshimu maana hakuta ndio serikali bila nyinyi hapa na joho akiwe kule tutakao unajua kwamba mwenzi wetu akututaye kwa hiyo kwa hapa dawa itakuwa imepatikana kwa hivyo ndugu zangu huyu ndugu alipojitolea nikasema mimi namshukuru kwa sababu mambo ambayo nimefanya na yeye ni makubwa ndugu yetu Hassan ni mjasiri kama alivyozungumziwa na watu wa Taita ni mtu mmoja mjasiri mtu mmoja shujaa na mtu mmoja ambaye akisema jambo lake huwa analiamini na hii safari si safari uh, maneno rahisi ni safari ngumu we need to change our way of approach ya siasa unajua sisi watu wa pande tuna ile ile iko pande ule ile iko pande ule hatuna nafasi ya kuweza kuja pamoja na kuzungumza kwa lugha nyingine kwa sababu we need to change hii uh, conversation uh, na hawa wenzetu ambao wengine wako ule mlango wa pili na ukweli ni kwamba at the moment katika nchi yetu ya Kenya nafasi bado iko very open katika presidency vile ambavyo ndugu yetu Hassan ameanza tutembee pamoja tuzungumze na wenzetu katika kuwafanya hata wao pia vile vile wajue ya kwamba ikiwa tuweza kushikana uh, tuwaweza kubadilisha ile ndoto ya wakenya ya kwamba hii Kenya ni ya watu fulani peke yake i think everybody in this country is desirous to see one day that this Kenya belongs to everybody of us every one of us hiyo ni kitu ambacho kinawauma kila kabila na yaeleweka ya kwamba it is possible but it requires uh, a leadership ambayo itakuwa na mtazamo huo i think time has come now with people like my brother here uh, ledama uh, the governor of uh, masabit wajia wajia eh na ndugu zetu wale wengine ambao tuko hapa wakina chicken choka hawa ni wanajeshi ambao ni wakuaminika i believe eh, we have a strong team na tukishikana pamoja hakuna kitu ambacho kitatuzuia otherwise uh, brother hasan i wish you well na itabidi pia tumombe mungu kama sio tumombe mungu kwa sababu mungu ndiye ana nini ana nguvu na na uwezo wa kumpatia mtu taji amtakaye na wakati ambao mwenyewe apopanga kama sivyo kwa hivyo asante sisi tukutakia heri sana na sisi tusimama na wewe kwa haya malengo na mimi nimemwambia paka watu ndani ya UDA kwa hii issue sisi we standards cost na nyinyi mkiona pia kuna jambo kwetu standards cost na kuna kubaguana tuende pamoja kwa kama watu wamoja na nakutakia heri ile siku kule kipigwa kama kuna grassroots we are major stakeholders katika hiki chama. Na mimi mpaka sasa sijaona kiongozi yote mwingine anaweza kuleta watu kwa pamoja kama ndugu yetu Hassan. Sijaona. Uh, I, I think uh, tukiangalia vile kulivyo na Hassan hii huifanyii kwa sababu yako peke yake. Unafanyia kwa sababu ya hawa viongozi wengine ambao kwamba ni wadogo wako. Uh, let their dream not die that wanafaa kufika paka deputy party leader peke yake let their dream die ya kwa wanaweza kufika party leader na presidency as well and mimi msimamo wangu na mimi na imani ya kwa ni msimamo wetu sote
Chama ambacho kwamba has united us and has brought us back to Republika is ODM. We need to ensure that our stake is inside that party. Wale ambao kwamba ni wabaya tuwatoe nje sisi tuhakikishe kwa tuko ndani na kuendelesha uh, chama and as you had rightfully put it as uh, the next elections uh, will be between ODM and everyone else and the flag bearer we believe is going to be you so mimi kutoa shukrani hata wale ambao kwamba tulopingana nao tuwalete karibu wale tulopingana nao wote tuwaite karibu hata wengine ambao kwamba wako katika vyama vingine mimi nina imani nina imani they will see which is the winning side wataona hapa ndio ambao kwamba kwenye ufaa one thing that i have to thank all of you is that you've been really strong all stood strong supported joho in this journey and now for me i'll speak like a politician because i'm speaking to politicians you know baba is going to au and when baba is going to au he's going to leave this field open there's no one who has got the monopoly of saying i'm the one who is going to take this all of us must stand strong and make sure that we bring our energies to synergize so that we see that the things that you've been fighting for you have a chance to be able to achieve them i tell people every day that sisi wote ni wapita njia you know ledama will come and go joho will come and go but what will remain is the land the people of the coast will always remain so we are now going to be judged on how we can work together there are so many temptations i can tell you that i've seen temptations with the people of the coast i can assure you one thing mimi mahali mutapita ndio mimi nitapita unaona and you know the thing about me mimi nikimaliza nimemaliza mimi hakuna vitu vingi ndugu yangu joe anachukua kwa sababu mimi nimesema the the strongest power that a man can have is his word tuliketi mimi joe junet tukaketi na babu tukasema let us fight, let us start talking to each other you know we did not say that we are following this person to go through this way but you know these things just fall in place zinaingiana you know me i want to tell you that wherever joho goes i am there unaona and i know that to a large extent mali hawa wote pamoja na wajia ndugu yangu niliona ile moto ilitokea wajia right now people are listening they are watching us and i'm telling you tuki lala tutapanga na tutapangwa vizuri sana. This is an opportunity for us. You people know your challenges. Your challenges are like our challenges. The future is among us. Okay? If we stand together, then we'll achieve much more. Lakini tile tukianza kusema ati oh wewe ni nani? Unajua sasa tuongee tu kweli, si ni wanasiasa. Mmoja wenu hapa anaweza anaweza yuko kwa mfuko tu kesha anza kusema Joho ni nani? Eh? Na umesahau kwamba nyinyi waswahili wenyewe mlisema usiwache champa chao si nasema nini usiwache champa chao kwa msala nini pitao unaona huu sasa hizi huu nakimbia kimbia hapa kwanza nyinyi you have a lot to lose you know you are your port here has been taken over ama niaje your port has been taken over so if you don't reclaim it i've told you you have the same problems we have sisi kwetu kule mbuga wa Masai Mara uko karibu kwenda hapa ile vita mimi nimepigana kule ndio naona joe akipigana hapa kuhakikisha bahari imebaki na nyinyi watu upande so if you guys are not serious mimi siwezi kuja hapa lakini mimi najua mahali joe hapo mimi nini niko hapo na nitawaambia hao ambao mnauliza mimi niko wapi wakati Raila Odinga akaenda kiapishwa pale ile ndio struggle ile kikweli kweli kulikuwa wapi na mimi mwenyewe ndo kumkaribisha karibu baba ujawapishwa mimi hasa njoo then you have the audacity today to ask me nilikuwa wapi wewe acha mchezo mimi si nimenyamaza lakini nikiamua tell them nazamua basi tell them tell them and i'm just saying this to you so that when when you, whenever you go stand strong Musi Musi go take you see stand solid Musi tissue Tutakutana hapo mbele sivyo So nataka kumalizia nikisema jana nilivyokuwa natoka Malindi Nikitoka Malindi pale Kuna bwana mmoja aliniita Kaambia bwana Nimeona mko na umoja bwana nyinyi mmebeba aspiration zetu nyingi 
tafadhali msiwachane sisi bana nimekaa tu na kikanzu chake kimoja pana kana kibakora kaambia inshallah so mujue hapa leo hapa hivi picha ikitoka hivi kuna watu chini watakuwa na hope kubwa sana sana kwa ma material of whatever situation we can still sit on one table and engage on matters ambayo zinahusu watu wetu laji so mimi nataka niseme tu tuwe pesi wa kusameheana when we wrong each other tubebane na tushirikiane kwa karibu sivyo tumekubaliana mambo ni matatu tushirikiane tuwe pesi wa kubebana na kusameheana na tujenge nini umoja wetu tumekubaliana kuna wale watu wanaangalia joho wanasema joho hawezi lakini mimi vile ambavyo kwamba ninamjua huu bwana yale matembezi nimetembea naye this is a product to sell anywhere yale walikuwa wanabandika cash fa nini nini wamefika wakati hana lolote tena la kuzungumza jo cha msingi ambacho mimi ningeomba kama team hatuendi kuonekana kwa debe ah ah no 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 hatuendi kwa tumeshaonekana vya kutosha we are going to prove a point na hivi vita mimi mwenyewe nimeviangalia viko mara tatu kwanza kuna position kwa kwa kwa, kwa ODM pili tuko na position kwa azimio na tatu ile position ya kwanza kabisa ya urais haya yote yatataka mikakati haya yote yatataka ujasiri matusi yatakuweko ili mradi tu ndio tuna hakika nani tunampeleka mbele kwa imani ya Mwenyezi Mungu ninaamini wale ambao hawaamini inawezekana na katika hali ya vile ambavyo iko sahi vyenye ruto ambavyo wamesambaratisha kila kitu we only need to fight and get that position on our side and i'm very sure god will fulfill